Okay, I've been trying to find somewhere out of the wind so I could give you all this update. Basically, do you all hear that wind? It is gusting. So this was supposed to be day one of the Elite Series. It's canceled. That means I get to sit here and talk to you guys a little bit today. So, not wearing my official jersey, nothing like that. Took that stuff off. Incognito right now, not like anybody knows me anyways. But, we're on St. John's River. where We're staying right on the lake, right on the river. And I want to tell you all this update of what me and Hunter have decided to do. So this year I'm fishing the Bassmaster Elite Series. There's nine events, and hopefully ten next year for the Bassmaster Classic. So, I'm guaranteed two years. And after that, nothing else is a guarantee. It's not even a guarantee I can fish next year unless I have some money. So basically, we're going to call this the Make or Break series. My YouTube videos, we're going to compile them all into a series and call my Bass Master Elite Series tournaments the Make or Break series. Because for me, that's what it is. I've, my whole life, I've been pretty much trying to get to this point. Hope you're going to hear me around this wind. But I've been trying to get to this point my entire life. Now that we're here, we have to stay here. So making it to the elites is hard enough to qualify through the opens. After that, you gotta stay here, find the sponsors, catch the fish, stay relevant. That's what we're trying to do now. So for me, this year and next year is very much so make or break. So me and Hunter traveling around. We're going from here straight to Chickamauga. Should be some really, really cool videos coming up. So if you have not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe. Turn the alerts on because you don't wanna miss these next two weeks of videos. It's gonna be awesome. So whenever you're watching this, well, the day this comes out, can't say when you're going to watch it, but the next day is the official day one of the Bass Master League Series. So log online, follow along on the action, get on Bass Track, see what I'm doing, and then the next video, go ahead and hit the subscribe button because the next video coming out will be some of my practice days. And then after that, I'm rolling out the tournament footage probably somewhere around next Tuesday or so will be tomorrow's footage. So can't say 100% yet. Hunter's kind of scheduling all that, but we are... Just trying to give you this update today the rest of this video is going to be me you know showing some clips from this trip so basically i've had some pretty cool experiences happen in this trip and i'm going to show them to y'all kind of what i went through on this trip i can't show any fish catches obviously because all my fish catches that i've stored are from the saint john's river and 88 of the best anglers in the world are going to be fishing out there tomorrow so i can't give them anything for free so basically hope y'all understand i can't show any fish catches but some pretty cool clips have came about and i filmed some of it haven't done a super good job filming because i'm not a vlogger i'm a fisherman who records him fishing I'm, i don't think about the camera so i'm not my first instinct when something happens my first instinct is not to record so i miss a lot of stuff the rest of the video is gonna look pretty choppy but hope you enjoy it it's been some pretty cool experiences and check back in a couple days for another video i'm ready to go tomorrow let's go bust them on I cannot tell you what I'm going to bust them on because this, this video is going out before the tournament starts. So let's go bust on some of my baits. So I'll tell you that. Let's go. go. Outside Walmart, Hunter picked him up in the frozen food. Made me take him outside. Look at there. $1,000 worth of batteries in my boat and I'm dead every day at 12 or 1 o'clock. Terrible. So it's worth $300 to get a few extra hours of practice. For these events so put new batteries in there see how long they last so hunter's been telling me for like three years she wants to go paddle boarding and water clear enough to see the bottom and have manatees under her well there's the bottom there's a manatee that's how clear that's two manatees actually that's how clear it is give me one second i'll show you a different one this thing it's unbelievable this is called silver glen springs i've been seeing like three or four four pounders 25 manatees there's one right there incredible there's a better look at that one look at him he just cruising over there rambling to herself <laughs> me and hunter woke up went for a run today now we're sitting out drinking a little bit of hotel coffee right there looking at the water looking at the sunrise so take y'all on what we do today what are we gonna do today wash the boat wash the boat rig some stuff let's go there it is all right we got the truck and the boat at the car wash, 
but all I brought was a 20. $20 in quarters for like I won on a slot machine. So I have not showed y'all the truck since I washed it. There it is, bling bling. And there's the boat wrap. Washed it up, got all the crap off of it. Looking good. Done a poor job vlogging today, but got a new prop put on. New light receptacle put on. Got an update done for my motor. Got some things open. Rods out. I was going to show y'all what I had rigged up, but I somehow forgot. That's going to be the main player tomorrow, I hope. hope. That. A couple Cinco's. Wacky rig. And that, hopefully. All that's going out of the boat right now. Don't need that in there. Extra weight. Got to take it all out. little pool table in the lobby so got everything buttoned up Just let miss hunter let us in everything's done no chest chesty tomorrow only gonna be the dash cam so see y'all in the morning frog cinco cinco couple chatter baits that's it back in the hotel room now everything's done covers on the boat i meant to show y'all my rods like i said earlier but didn't show y'all what we did today just to recap light receptacle change Prop change, prop exchange. They Ranger guy, shout out to that dude. He handled it quickly, changed my light receptacle, and fixed my passenger boat seat in like 15 minutes. Pretty impressive. They tore my motor down, fixed the uh, water pressure screen on my engine, gave it an update, and then switched my prop out. Then I had to go to Bass, take some pictures, get some stickers put on the side of my boat, fill out some more paperwork, go to the meeting. Everything is done, everything's finished. Just showed y'all the pool table out there, the koi fish. That's where we're staying at this week. That's a wrap. That's a wrap for this practice day. If you want to watch the tournament video, hit that subscribe button. Turn the alerts on. Don't miss the video. It'll be out in probably two days after this video. So tournament starts tomorrow for me. Two days for y'all. Check back. See y'all later. So you want to see how you eat healthy on the road? Healthy-ish on the road? Take your little croissant thing. Throw that part in the trash. Can't eat that. What you're left with is that. That's what you can eat. You hear that wind? That's why we ain't out there. It's not rough here, but on south or north, it would be nasty. So, we have an off day. I'm not supposed to receive any information, but I just found what they're on. That's it, St. John's River. That's where we'll be fishing this week.